What's going on guys? Clearing out some old footage from today. This is actually some footage from maybe a month, a month and a half ago, maybe even a little bit longer. I really am not sure when I went over there, but it's been at least a month. So went over to a lake pretty close to my house, pretty close to where I grew up, Lake West Point. A lot of y'all probably know about it. Bass Masters have been there a couple times and they have a good Wednesday night tournament at a Yellow Jacket boat ramp where there'll be like 50 boats in it. It's probably like the average 40 to 50 boats and they pay back like one in five spots. So if there's 50 boats, they'll pay back like 10 spots. So it's pretty ridiculous. You get paid almost every single time if you catch them halfway decent. So went on over there and decided to, you know, fish my strength. That's what I do whenever I don't have any practice. I just like to stay in the river. I like to fish, you know, main river, green stuff, lay down, stuff like that. So without further ado, went over there, jumped in the boat with a good buddy of mine, and we went out and tried to catch as many bass as we could. Been pretty tough. Weight's been pretty low. So for this tournament, I think it's only going to take 12 or 13 pounds usually to win this time of year. So keep that in mind while we're fishing, and I will see you at the end of the video. All right, guys, we're out here in the Wednesday night tournament over here on West Point Lake right now. We got one fish, didn't have the camera on, and uh, I'm going to try to catch us four more big ones. That's a keeper. 12 inches, you don't think he is? No, he probably ain't. Let me see if he's 14. Huh? Let me see if this one's 14. Spot. No, he, he ain't make it, is he? 13. What more did you get him on? Flipping it. Three. At least there's a couple willing to bite flipping today. Last time we fished there, was it? How big was that spot, 11 and a half? Yeah. All right, let's go. That's a perfect tree. That's the first fish I've ever caught of it. Though. God, I just spooked a big and God dog, like a five pounder. He came right up under that bush too. And I'm hungry in again. He came out and went straight out here. That was a good one, good one too. Big and you see him right there? Big and mm -hmm. when he laid in there like that. That's what I'm talking about. That's freaking awesome, dude. That one over there is about the same size. This ain't but a, that one over there might have been bigger, I don't know. You didn't see him even until I cast? No, I seen him. <laughs> he ain't that big. He's worth catching up here. Now that's how they're supposed to do. If we get four bites on that frog, we're gonna win.
Think we can get some bites in there? We got we got enough time to fish it and some more river stuff, so. See all these? A lot of mayfly shells. All right, so Hope y'all enjoyed that video. I actually got some really cool frog fish. One really big one that was awesome. I threw my frog over this little log jam and while I was working it back, a fish actually came up and looked at it and I reeled it away from the fish. And after I saw the fish was behind it, I actually sped up my reel to make sure I got the bait in. Cause what you don't want to do is draw the fish too far away from the cover and get him too close to the boat. So I reeled my bait up as fast as possible and then threw back over his head back towards the cover to try to get him to turn and go back the other way so he'll be going away from the boat. I do that a lot when I'm sight fishing for cruisers and stuff. I want them to be facing away from me and not getting closer and closer to the boat. And I actually caught him, nice, probably four pound or maybe four and a quarter. And we ended up with, I can't remember how much, eight and a half, eight and three quarter pounds, maybe even nine pounds. Ended up getting paid a little bit of money, got our money back for fishing and got to have a good time, caught some fish, just never caught five, only weighed in four that day. And that's it. So hope you enjoyed that video. Go ahead and leave a like, leave a comment, hit that subscribe button. Me and Hunter's about to leave and go to New York. So go ahead and subscribe. I've been saying that for eight videos in a row, but now, now we're serious. We're about to go tomorrow.